Hello, my name is Frank and I will tell you about GPT-2 simple example in that video. So, let's have a look at our example. We are going to generate text from GPT-2 model. Then first, what we are going to do is import our libraries. We use transform Transformers library from Hugging Face. You can see that on the GitHub Hugging Face Transformers. Then we create prompt text. My name is Frank and I'm doing project on Upwork. Then we encode our text with tokenizer from uh, GPT-2. And also we create lists of bad word IDs which we are not want to see in our generated text. Next, uh, we just see encoded prompt the numbers, uh, numbers, uh, and uh, choose device. CUDA two is uh, our GPU, a third GPU on our server. So then, uh, we transfer our model to device uh, and transfer encoded prompt to device to that video card. Next, uh, we just create generate text from our encoded uh, prompt uh, sentence uh, we put into generate function encoded prompt and end of statement token um, max length temperature uh, petition penalty bad word that is another param so uh, then we can try to generate the text may execute every cell and see what we've got Okay, my name is Frank, I'm doing project on Upwork and I'm a young man with no idea what it's like to be in the world of video games and something about the RPG and so on. What we can do, we can change the repetition penalty, for example, for 1.01 and see results. My name is Frank, I'm doing work on Upwork, I've been working on this for a long time and I want to share it with you all. I'm a professional artist who can work on many pro projects uh, over the years. Uh, then, uh, that's uh, how Vanilla GPT-2 works, you generate text from it, then we can do training. Training of our model. Uh, for spe special tasks. For example, we want to paraphrase. Uh, we uh, have a, a data set in, in that file uh, with paraphrases. Uh, let me show how, uh, how that, that data set looks like. So this is our data set which we are going to use to learn our model. My sister just called and yelled at me and said I would I was disappointed of uh, out of nowhere. And so we have paraphrases. I'm sorry your sister called and yelled at you. And so on. So we have different paraphrases here which we are going to use to build our model. Close that and see uh, how we are going to build our model. Okay. Now we are going to have a train cycle here, a uh, typical train cycle for PyTorch, and uh, we put into that uh, train uh, our model and uh, what we are going to learn from our data. Uh, next. Uh, 
we can see Recorded results and um, uh, let's try to see if we just put our uh, fresh like uh, Frank lost his case and we've got nothing we've got an n plus one and plus one and something strange let's uh, tune fine tune our model to get better results So just execute a learning process. We got fine-tuned model and matrix history here. It will take time, about two minutes to train, it. and so let's see results after training. Okay, we have trained our model, and uh, then we can see results now uh, so we print i like your car and have preference i'm glad you like your car uh, and we can change uh, here and put here different phrase uh, uh, So, for example, if we put I lost my keys, uh, model prints, uh, I'm sorry you lost your keys. So, here we can use different um, types of uh, data sets we learn, we fine tune our model and solve different tasks. Uh, and this is example for paraphrasing, but we can use uh, that for different tasks and for text generate generation. Okay, so I hope this video will help you to understand more about GPT-2.